Hot springs are an interesting geologic phenomena which are typically associated with volcanic activity. As an example, thousands of hot springs exist within Yellowstone National Park in Wyoming, such as the massive Great Prismatic Spring. Smaller volcanoes such as Lassen Peak in California also contain hot springs. Thus, you would only expect to find hot springs scattered across volcanically active states in the western United States. However, there is one major exception to this overall trend, Arkansas. Within Arkansas is a series of several dozen hot springs which lie within Hot Springs National Park. Yet, there are no recent volcanoes within the state. So, why do these hot springs exist? This video will discuss this geologic oddity and how it formed. The Hot Springs National Park is located in central Arkansas where it is 46 miles west-southwest of the city of Little Rock. This park contains at least 47 hot springs which naturally release water at a temperature averaging 143 degrees Fahrenheit or 62 degrees Celsius. Although this is too hot to touch without getting burned, numerous bathhouses exist which cool this superheated water to a more pleasant temperature. So, why is the water so warm? The closest volcano to Hot Springs National Park is the Carrizozo Volcano located in New Mexico which is more than 750 miles to the west. Thus, these hot springs are not heated by volcanic activity. This may come as a surprise, but all water needs to become superheated is to travel deep into the crust of the planet. Depending on where you are on the planet, the crust heats up in temperature between 2 and 14 degrees Fahrenheit for every 1,000 feet in depth. The water which flows out of these hot springs originate at a depth of up to 8,000 feet where it was heated to a temperature of 160 degrees Fahrenheit. With this being said, it is unusual for groundwater to penetrate this deep into the Earth's crust. The reason why this was able to occur is the region's geology. This section of Arkansas contains a series of small mountains referred to as the Washita Mountains. From satellite, you can observe that this mountain range contains abundant straight-lying high points. These ridges represent the top of geologic folds which make up the majority of this mountain range. The significant folding and faulting within this 300 million year old mountain range has created a series of long cracks which allows water to seep deep into the crust. It takes approximately 4,000 years for the water to reach 8,000 feet deep. Once the water is heated there, some of it travels back up to the surface through two large faults known as the Alpha and Beta faults. These faults act as a path of least resistance allowing water to reach the surface with a high temperature a mere 4,400 years later. Thus, the water which flows out of these hot springs today went into the crust during the same time frame as the construction of the Great Pyramids of Giza. If you decide to visit these hot springs, you might notice an unusual gray rock adjacent to these features. This rock type is known as tufa, which is a variety of calcium carbonate deposited in small volumes by the output of these hot springs. As a final note, this national park is not too far from both Mount Ida where hand-sized transparent quartz crystals can be mined and Crater of Diamonds State Park where numerous diamonds can be found. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to request a specific topic, please leave a comment below. Additionally, if you would like to support this channel, consider becoming a patron on Patreon.